she'll stop the, the family when they're walking on a very hot day and she'll let the babies sleep and she'll stand with all the females around the calves and shade them from the hot sun. What's up, what's up, what's up? I'm happy to be back. It's been two weeks without making any videos. Well, not without making videos. I was filming a lot, but I wasn't able to upload or edit anything because I wasn't home most of the time. Did not enjoy being away. I mean, I enjoyed being away. I didn't enjoy not uploading. Um, I hope you guys forgive me for that. The past one month became so much busier than I anticipated. So I guess it's a good thing. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Hopefully, August will be a month where I can chill a bit and get to edit a lot of content that I've done. A series that is a surprise coming soon. A seven episode series that. Be excited, be excited. These are good things. But I'm happy to be uploading this video now. And this one is all about elephants and Amboseli. It's easily one of my favorite parks in Kenya. Because elephants, I love elephants. Any of you follow me on Instagram. If you follow me there, you know that I absolutely love elephants. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, why? Follow this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Uh, 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 uh. Truthling on Twitter, Truthling on Instagram. Follow me. Thank you. I got to be in Amboseli for a whole week thanks to Amarula and Wildlife Direct. Thank you so much, you guys know how to take care of your guests. Got to hang out with Instagrammers from all over the world, from Canada, the US, South Africa, from Germany, from Brazil. I don't know why I have to say, I feel like when I'm saying Brazil, it has to be, you can't just say Brazil. It has to be Brazil. <laughs> wow, We're doing three game drives a day. Morning game drive. Morning game drive. Hey, dream. What is going on? Morning game drive at six in the morning. Another morning game drive at nine in the morning. So we do the 6 a.m. one. Go shoot the sunrise elephants. If we catch any of them, it was cold. So we weren't sure. Sometimes lions. Come back for breakfast, like around eight. Day two in the Amboseli. I did not make it for the sunrise shoot. Even the ones who couldn't wake up for the morning one. Then after breakfast, head back out for the second game drive. Come back to the hotel by around lunchtime, maybe 12, somewhere there. Have lunch, chill for a bit, edit pictures if you need to edit, charge your devices if you need to. For me, take a nap. Then around three, four, we head out for the final game drive, which is now to try to the sunset. The best thing about this time in the Amboseli is that we were hanging out with guys from Wildlife Direct. We were with Dr. Paula Kahumbu, who you, may, you guys might know as the most recognized personality in 
elephant conservation in Kenya and maybe Africa, maybe the world. We were hanging out with the guys who actually research and hang out with these elephants every single day for like 20 years plus. It's ridiculous. They live in the park. They've named all the elephants in the Amboseli ecosystem. This is 1600 elephants. 1600. It's like you have cheat codes of elephant behavior right with you. Many thanks to Soila, many thanks to Dr. Paula Kahumbu. These guys gave their knowledge, their wisdom for free. one of these sunset game drives that we went and we found these three cubs that were playing with the with the lioness who i assume is their mom oh my goodness these cubs you just want to like chuka, chuka, hey cub hey, hey, hey. but of, of course i didn't because i'd have no fingers it's like they knew the cameras were watching they were just there just chilling just prancing around just These elephants were so many and they just crossed and they were in this long line and they were just in a row like this, one after the other and they just crossed, just kept going, just kept going, just kept going and going. Oh. Oh. And one of the things I love is also like the baby, the tiny baby elephants as they're learning to use their trunk, you can see they're going to be these magnificent, these huge creatures, but they're so tiny. Let's say China. Wow, dude. World Elephant Day is on Saturday 12th, tomorrow of August. So it's a perfect day to learn as much as you can about elephants. And I know this video is coming out today on Friday, but tomorrow there's a new video that I'm also putting up, which is like a cinematic cut of all the footage I shot in Amboseli. And it's been done by Trevor. It's a collaboration between the two of us. And one of my favorite Kenyan musicians, Blinky Bill, has given us the music for this specific video. Man, I can't wait for you guys to see that because I'm sure it's going to be fire bomb fire. This is a perfect day to go to a park and see elephants. Go to your national park, pay, go hang out with elephants. Take a day, take two days. If you're in Kenya, you can see elephants in Meru, in Mount Kenya, in Samburu, in Amboseli, in Savo. So really, go out and see elephants in the wild. Or, or, Take your kids to David Sheldrick. Let them see baby elephants. Oh, they will enjoy seeing those baby elephants. Let them develop this love affair early. Let them get a fascination for elephants. Wow, dude. Thanks for watching. It's been a pleasure uploading again. Oh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, share it with a friend. And bye, 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 bye. See you in the next video next week. True story. I promise. Bye bye.